Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be answering a question that comes up pretty frequently as a gymnast. So this question is, should I get buckle or should I get Velcro grips? I'm going to be answering that today and we are going to be making a pros and cons list and I'm going to tell you my opinion and my gym's opinion, but if you have a different opinion, that is totally okay. This is just what I think, and if you do something different, that is totally fine. Play whiteboard here, and I am going to start drawing our pros and cons list. Okay, so I made our pros, our pros and cons list. The red looks orange for some reason. But, um, so we, I'm just going to start off listing them. And, but first let me tell you what I recommend. Okay, so I definitely recommend getting buckle grips just because they, I, my coach wants us to only have buckle grips because the Velcro, when she was a gymnast, um, the Velcro, it, doesn't last long, so it won't stay on. So she had to like tape it on there. And so Velcro just doesn't last as long. And buckle grips are more reliable and they're more sturdy, if that makes any sense. And Velcro grips are more hard to explain. Velcro grips aren't as reliable. And so buckle grips are just a lot safer because if the Velcro comes undone, that is super duper dangerous. And so I just recommend buckle grips because I feel like they are more safer, they are more reliable, but the only thing is, is they're a bit more expensive. Okay, so I made my list and I could go on and on, I think any gymnast probably could, about the pros and cons of buckle and Velcro grips, but I just put my biggest ones on there, and so I will read them off to you. So the buckle grips, the pros on those, they are safer because the Vel um, there's no Velcro on there that could get caught on the bar, or that could put, well, yeah, put you in danger. And then they also last longer. The cons, though, they are more expensive, and they in my opinion, are harder to get on. And then the Velcro grips, the pros, they are cheaper. They are easier-ish to get on. And then the cons list is a bit bigger in my perspective. They could be dangerous. Um, they won't last as long because of the Velcro. And some gyms actually find it distracting for the girls because they keep on fixing their grips. And the Vel the buckle grips, you can keep on fixing them, but it takes a bit longer to get on. And so it is kind of just a waste of time if you keep on putting them on and putting them back on. But the Velcro ones, they could slide or get loose. And so it's just a bit easier to go with the buckle grips for putting them on. But it is easier to put the, Vel the Velcro grips on, if that, um, on and then the buckles aren't as distracting, if that makes any sense. So like I said before, this is just my opinion. If you have a different opinion, that is totally okay. And so I'm just telling you the my pros and cons of Vel Velcro. I just like completely combined in those words. Buckle and Velcro grips. Um, I only had um, buckle grips. I like them. And my coach, um, the Velcro girls that are gym, um, some of them have that and that's just okay. Um, totally okay. But I just recommend the buckle grips because the Velcros aren't as um, safe. And when you get to the higher levels, they are probably going to want you to start using um, buckle grips because they are safer and they um, kind of stay on a bit better because the Velcro isn't sliding like ankle weights for vaults. They don't, they don't, they get a bit looser sometimes. So be kind, subscribe, and stay safe.